Hey guys, welcome back to another custom ROM review for Redmi Note 4. This time we have Orion OS based on Android 15. So I have been using this ROM few days now. This is a pretty good ROM actually. And as you can see, it is running on Android 15. And this is the official version of Orion OS. And Orion OS version is 15.1. The security patch level is 5th February 2025. So this one is the latest build of Orion OS for this device. The UI is pretty much similar to all other AOSP based rom so android 15 based rom in terms of customization we do have molecular section here and there are tons of customization available and you can tweak as you're liking in the miscellaneous section we do have component spoofing play integrative fix google photo spoof and few other things higher fps in game all those things are available and also we are getting few other options here so there are tons of customization in terms of network and internet connectivity, so Wi-Fi, Bluetooth working perfectly fine, but no VLT and no Wi-Fi. So one of the downside actually. In terms of sound and vibration, no issue with that. Working perfectly fine, sound and vibration working. The display section, adaptive brightness is working. Dark theme is available, and few other things like double tap to work and double tap to sleep. All those things are working, as you can see here working perfectly fine and we do have torch sitting here as this device is called dual tone flash so you can calibrate the torch according to your liking in the wallpaper and style section we don't really have any kind of ai wallpaper or anything like that obviously this is a pretty old device and it got pretty low specs hardware so because of that actually you cannot do any kind of ai task here so the default wallpaper is there and there are a few other things in the more lock screen option so as you can see ambient display option also a bible so these things are a bible pretty much similar to all other osp based rom nothing new here in terms of battery the battery is doing pretty well actually no drain issue at all and charging control option also a bible charging mode schedule and limit charging all those things battery information although they are not really reliable but the options are there in the system setting we do have few other options like gestures navigation mode we have three button navigation gesture navigation is also available but doesn't work as you can see here even after selecting the gesture navigation we are not getting any kind of full screen gesture here the only gesture option is like you have to use the buttons so those are available and one hand mode and few other things swipe to take a screenshot so that is working as you can see here so in terms of setting these are available and in the security and privacy setting the face and fingerprint unlock both of them working perfectly fine so as you can see here pretty fast actually fingerprint unlock and the face unlock is also working but slower side so as you can see here both of them work perfectly fine and we do have private space as android 15 based rom private space is available password setting and few other things so these are the things and i have already disabled animation on this rom because with animation it will struggle a lot in terms of application we are not getting a lot here and this is not a gfs build so if you install this rom you have to flash gfs separately we do have few application here and the rom did come with a gcam here this one is gcam go and it is working pretty well so we can take picture and 4k recording is working so if i select 4k 30 fps 4k 30 fps and if i record now so the recording is going on as you can see here so 4k recording is working and in terms of other feature we do have dolby atmos option here and whatsapp is working perfectly fine no issue with that but we don't really have any kind of safety net feature here because of that you will not be able to install any kind of bank application here so if i show you that setting about so as you can see a device is not certified so you can't use bank application there will be a few other application which will not work on this rom we do have by preferred fx and this all actually in terms of calling i did take phone call phone call is working perfectly fine no issue with that as i said bo lt and bo wi-fi not working and although we do have background call recorder application here but background call recording is not working so you can't record calls on this rom in terms of gaming the gaming performance is not really that great but for this device as i expected it is performing well actually i don't really have anything to complain about gaming performance here it is doing pretty well 
and in terms of google photos google photos unlimited storage is available as i said in terms of other features like circle to search and anything like that those things are not available here but as far as usability goes the rom is pretty fluent and it works really well as you can see here no lag or anything like that phone call is also working and it is a pretty much daily drivable rom if you don't use bank application i think you can install this rom and try out this rom you are getting latest android here by the way this is a 3gb 32gb variant of redmi note 4 so if you have a 4gb 64gb variant of this device you might get better experience out of this rom so it is a pretty much usable rom and i have already activated the private space so private space is also working so if i try that so as you can see here that feature is also working so pretty much usable rom and if anyone wants to try this rom i will put the rom link in the description below that's all about it so thank you very much for watching and i will see you in the next one